Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Butri and playing Boom Beach with Dr. Terrace here, and I'm gonna be smacking him down with all scorches. I'm talking about like eight landing crafts with scorches on it. So uh, let's hold up the game, and here we go. This is my base, and I'm gonna be showing you guys this beauty mean steals i'm telling you this is the awesome combo this is the kamikaze combo basically they run in burn everything and explode like a banana guys explode like a banana so let's waste time let's jump over to the first stage here of dr terror and i'm gonna be trying to tossing those uh, barrages and material shells on the hq and i really hope there's gonna be enough damage to take down the hq and now as you see here right now it's not enough i'm actually lacking 10 percent on the hq's hp so so uh, we're gonna be trying another attempt where I'm gonna be dropping those scorchers and we're gonna be mixing it up with critters. With critters and scorchers, it's gonna be hand danging blasting, guys. So, okay, the uh, scorchers are starting to burn up things here, and I'm tossing two boxes of critters, and the critters are already doing amazing damage. Look at those critters, they're just it's a bit firing from their eyes or nose. I don't know what they're firing from, but I think it's from the eye. The eye beam. <laughs> the eye beam. Okay, we took down the stage one, and it's time to go over to the terror stage two here. And I'm just gonna be dropping down those scorches like a banana. <laughs> <laughs> like a banana anyways let's not talk about the banana or maybe we talk about the coconut now we're not gonna be talking about the coconut so anyways the critters are smacking this the hq and it just went down again guys it just went down the question is how is the third stage six and seven of when you're using all scorchers will it be possible i i definitely think it's gonna be possible because scorchers got a lot of hp and they do they they do decent damage and uh, when they actually die or what a defensive uh, building takes down a scorcher the scorcher explode and do massive damage so it's absolutely cool to use this uh, combo so let's see if you drop down on any scorches at all i'm not sure if, if we're gonna be losing any scorches at all that's a big question so there we go we just took it down and it's time to jump over to the next stage here the next stage is third stage four and this is actually getting more harder right now but it's it's not gonna be hard for me but for a lower level gameplay, I definitely see this is harder. A, a lot more mines, a lot more boom mines scattered up. Uh, we have like uh, cannons and mortars. And mortars are super devastating when you're low level. Because they're doing tons of damage on level 1 riflemen. If you, if you guys understand what I mean here. <laughs> if you guys understand it. <laughs> I feel like super hyped guys. So anyways, the critters and the scorchers are doing some cooperation again And there we go third stage four just went down I just took his loot and resources and those fragments like a banana I just said banana again. What is up with the banana guys? Okay, so third stage five here We have like two shock launchers on the left side and basically what I'm gonna be doing here is taking down the front scorcher The, the front shock launcher and the scorches are already burning that score. <laughs> wow, that was so much damage in like seconds i took down the the, the shock launcher within like three seconds it was like burn boom it was done it was gone guys it was gone i'm telling you bruce lee is real anyways let's continue the third stage five so okay the hq is tasting a lot of uh pain right now or should i get a uh, burnt damage is that correct word say burnt damage never mind i'm burning the hq and the critters and the scorches are still cooperating here and i'm just getting him down like a crazy danger guys like a crazy danger so there we go thursday five just went down and i'm just having a great fun i'm really hoping you guys are enjoying this because uh scorches are actually a rare gameplay to see uh from youtubers out there boom youtubers uh, be, uh rarely use uh, all scorches that's because they're expensive um sometimes you need to boost them up to uh be a real to to uh to be good because because the scorchers basically uh, uh move slow and they do um low damage when they're burning but if you stack them up with a lot of hp they can just run down or cruise down to the hq and burn it and boom it's gone guys i'm telling you it's it's gone when the scorchers are getting close to the hq we're talking about the evil explosion guys <laughs> evil explosion sometimes i feel crazy but i'm not crazy guys you guys know the general i'm talking like this and i just love using combos like this the scorchers are awesome they're red they're big and they're totally mean guys so we're getting close to third stage seven here and uh it's gonna be i i actually think that i i won't be losing any uh scorches at all but we're gonna be finding that out on the next stage the terror stage six was 
pretty much easy here. I didn't lose anything at all. That's because I used the power of the critters. The critters are doing the magic. You drop them boxes from the sky upon the HQ and you pretty much blast it. It's pretty much like that, guys. So, okay. Time to head over to third stage 7 here, and uh, we got like one threat there, it's actually the, uh, the, the shock launcher at the start there, well, the left uh, shock launcher is not going to be any hassle, it's going to be easy to take care of that, the only problem was the start, the, uh, this, the uh, shock launcher at the start of the beach and no worries my, my my scorchers are doing the job here right now while the left shock launcher there is actually shocking just one scorcher what are you doing bro do you even lift or do you use brains I, I don't think you're using brains when you're tossing those shocks anyways I'm repositioning my my scorchers over to the left side and that looks like I'm gonna be losing one scorches already and I'm just not gonna be watching that because I, I don't want to see that scorcher fail I don't want to See the skull, oh my dangers of the dangleberry. The berry is real, and the Bruce Lee and the dragon and everything, guys. I'm telling you, that is so real. So, I still have like seven scorches here. I lost like one scorches only. So, let's keep on rocking. We're gonna be heading over to the HQ and we're gonna be burning that HQ to the ground very, very soon. As, uh, as, as soon as I take in down those defensive buildings surrounding the HQ. So, okay, I'm keeping that a uh, boom cannon shocked up, and uh, you see it, it's standing still, it's not actually firing my scorches i'm blasting his hq tossing some critters upon that hq and the critters are helping me and the boom cannons are actually getting distracted there by the critters and i'm actually gonna be taking down this guy right now or dr terry's tasting my juice and my pain and the berry guys the berries tasting the berry look at this i'm burning and all of my scorches are booming there we go thursday 7 just went down guys so I hope you guys enjoyed this video because uh, I think it's a lot of fun uh, playing the Scorchers. All Scorchers, I call them the, the Scorchers Kamikaze because basically you run in and they explode when they die and you pretty much win. And so that's like uh, uh, just a rush combo. So anyways, um, I do have like a lot of prototype modules and I was thinking like what kind of prototype defense should I build? And I'm thinking like maybe I should build up like two damage amplifier. That would be actually interesting because I haven't seen anyone using two damage amplifiers. I see a lot of doom cannons, shock launchers and only one damage amplifier. I want to see how they actually work when you have like two of those and you have like ice tattoos boost it up so anyways i'm getting close to that so i hope you guys stick your eyes to the screen i'm coming very very soon see you guys soon keep on booming goodbye boom <laughs>